So, today is now Thursday in lockdown, um, but some positive news, and I will show you, I bought myself a car yesterday. So, for those of you who don't know, I don't drive. Lauren has had to chauffeur me around for like the last eight years, and all of my friends have had to do exactly the same, and I've been an absolute pain. I had dread to think how much money I've spent on um, Ubers, and just taxis and trains and etc. So I bought myself a little Ford Focus yesterday. I'm gonna stick some learner plates on it and Lauren is going to teach me how to drive. So I'm absolutely buzzing to do this, even though I am very nervous. I haven't driven a car since I last passed my theory, which was about seven, eight years ago. So yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Uh, we're going to the range because I need to buy like loads of car crap. But what I'll do when we leave the house, which hopefully will be in the next like 20 minutes, providing Lauren get, gets her shit together. We will, uh, I'll show you the car, because I'm absolutely buzzing about it. Like, I can't believe my car is parked in the car park. So, so today's turning out to be a pretty good day. Let's wait and see. Um, but I'll uh, show you my car shortly, and uh, then we get going. So guys, this is my new car. Yeah, it's got a few dents, but I didn't do that. But this is it, absolutely buzzing. Little uh, dark blue four focus and I've parked it for the first time today, and I am in the lines. I went into a bit quick, Lauren shit herself, but <laughs> I was in and I was safe and I didn't hit anybody, but this is the beauty. This is my car. My little L plate, there it is. Some little drive around in the car park, just doing well, learning that clutch control. How are you feeling, babe? Nervous. Fine, we'll tackle roundabouts when he's more confident. But yeah, it's just clutch control that I'm a little bit I just don't want to lose the clutch on the middle of the road. Do you know what I mean? It's like going up and going down. But that's why you have work. your old plates on, so people can't keep back and they're aware that you're learning. Mm. So that's fine. We'll keep should, you we, up there, should we go onto the main road then? Well, we need to go to Boots. We may as well do that whilst we're well, here. Should I just leave the car here then? No. You want me to drive it up there? Yeah. And park it amongst all of those cars? Yeah. I don't feel like that's a good idea at the minute. <sighs> I don't want to walk there from here. There's loads of spaces up there. Oh, we'll give it a go. So guys, I drove here in my new Ford Focus and we didn't kill or crash anybody, crash into anybody. I'm now in the range and we're now gonna pick a barbecue up. I smell that candle. It smells incredible. Mm. Yeah, smells Look, like how, look how big it is, it was only a tenner. That's Bargain, what's tenor. the smell? It smells like old people. No, it doesn't, it smells like jasmine, jasmine or something. It's yeah. really nice. Yeah, but where are you going to put it? I don't want that in the house. I can put it in my office. Show us. It's eleven ninety nine. It's a bargain. I might get it and put it in my office. You haven't even got into your office yet. We like this one. I'm getting it. This one's, oh, for God's sake. This one's cool, we thought. Like that. And I've just picked up for the bedroom. This that one. That is twenty. making a mess here. I've just picked up this for the bedroom, which we thought was really, really cool. That is our flat aesthetics to a T. 749. More penguins. Do you want it? Yeah, but where are we going to put it? It's battery powered. How? There's no lights battery in it. Battery powered illuminated wall art. There is. It's something lights up. What lights up? It doesn't say what lights up, but I think that's There's no cool. bulbs in it, but it is cute, but we don't really have anywhere to put it. It's not just mad, so that means he's rolled in shit, isn't it? looks it? like fudge. Yeah. We've got loads of, they've got loads of ones. What? this. Just spotted this, I thought this was really cute. A series of mental images, ideas and emotions occurring in certain stages of sleep. An ambition, one that is extremely pleasant, beautiful or fine. A bit of stationery, really, that little mini clipboards. 50 sheets. Don't know who, who's going to use them. Yeah, exactly. What do you need them for? Just love a book. Josh has got about 20 notebooks. Just love them. This is the one that I bought the other day, look. Material, suede. 
£2.49. Well, I bought all that other stuff. I've got it in here. Oh, yeah, we ordered it off Amazon. It was a complete nightmare. These are all cheap. You don't need one that's that big for your car. No, This, this is, is a barbecue, yeah, that we were looking at yesterday that we need to get for Josh's parents to have a barbecue at their house over the weekend. Oh, in that goes. No question. We need a bigger trolley, I think, babe. We don't need too much for a start. We need some coal. You're going to need a big bag, aren't you? Yeah. I'll just get one of these. Broke. To put stuff in, I don't know what stuff. Emergency stuff just goes up right there. I need like a blanket and stuff. Are you going to get one of those triangle fluorescent things to put out for when yeah. you break down? Of course I am. He's such Safe a loser. First. <laughs> no, darling, it's the summer. Um, I need some snelly pie. Tangerine. Oh, that smells nice. Oh, too fruity. <laughs> Can't smell it. Yeah, you probably can't smell it through the package. That's five pounds. Yeah, air fresheners, but the little tree ones are a pound. A bit pink and girly though. Yeah, they've got to have some more. We've, we'll, all we'll, have, we'll be able to get some in Tesco. Not a Lincoln's one, but that's a bit too long there, isn't it? Car shampoo, do you want car shampoo? Not unless you're going to wash these. It's, you've got to go down into one of the aisles. Here we go, the manly set. Well, these car mats here. They're horrible. It's all that or pink. No, this is plain black material ones there, but do you need new ones? I don't really need new ones at the minute. No. Shall I get an umbrella? People normally have an umbrella to put in their boots. It's up to you, mate. Just in case it rains. I'll get that when I pass. Yeah. Um, I don't really know what I'm looking for. What's where? The trolley bit. It's definitely got Corona. Um, I don't know which one to go for. Black ice. What is black oh, that's, that's lovely. I love black ice. Anyone else love black ice for air fresheners? I think they're so nice. What do they smell? What does black ice Really smell? fresh, like... I don't know how to describe it, but it is nice, promise. Oh, we'll get that, we'll get that vanilla aroma. Ugh, well. I hate vanilla. Just in case. We'll get a couple of them. Oh, that's just in case. Yeah, yeah. Window scraper, do I need one of them? No, again, you probably only need one in the winter once you've passed, babe. Uh, dash cam. <laughs> no. Probably not for my own good. I need, I've got wipes and stuff, don't need them. Oh, we want one of those things, don't we? Yeah. Where things he means something you can clip your phone onto. This is a charger. I'm gonna get one of them as well. This is a jewel. I can plug in two. Plug in two. Oh, okay, yeah, so we can both charge at the same time. Yeah. So I get that. Well, someone's broken into that one. Of course I have wind slam. Uh, right, so we get this. And then here we go. And the air vent phone mount. Yeah, they're quite good. We'll show you it in the car. Car accessories, now we need charge. I'm sure we don't need anything else. No, babe. He hasn't even passed yet and he thinks he needs to like, deck out his car with everything. Just spotted this little water feature. How cute is that? By the garden. Packing my new car up, aren't I? Oh, shit, we just bought. I'll have to sort it all out. Stick that on for me. Spray the seats. We'll get the Febreze brand new air freshener open. Oh, and for breeze for the seats. Look, I'm gonna need to put oh, the camera down to do this. Bear with. 
one that's lovely. A bit of black ice. Little trees, black ice. Love that smell. Keep my car nice and clean. I'm going to have to carry a bag. Just chucking all my rubbish in here. You got your rubbish there, bud? No, I've yeah. just got to pull this stuff away from me. He's left okay. me with like a pile of stuff on my lap, so I need to organise all of this. Doing his little phone holders phone and, and, and stuff. And then so, we're going to go to Tesco's to get food and more chocolate as This is usual. literally a small little device, but look, you see, it's got two two in just that in like that little lights come on to tell me they're just working there's a little wire here that you can then plug this phone into the only thing you don't have do you have a holder you've got the holder oh it's in the boot i'll get it now bear with bear with the back is it my little holder cost me 2.99 but this just means when i do pass because this car's a bit old i can just put um my speaker on and when people call me i can put it on that speaker safety first that's it so just put that little clip there and i clip it on to it onto there hold my phone that way you see i'll demonstrate that to you now oh i've got a notification there we go and it holds it there for me like that and then Let's open this, the final bit to the puzzle. Touch wood, it all charges, because otherwise my phone is gonna die. It will, I bought one of these as well. Josh's got a nice pink wire here. Yeah. Maybe a bit of lilac, in fact. Looks very nice. <laughs> it's boiling in there, isn't it? Oh, nice and warm. Into there. Into there. Phone is on charge. Fun times, okay. Now we're going to head off to Tesco's. Josh is going to drive us there. Um, it's going to be interesting. Oh, nice. had to stop start. Did his first roundabout. Stalled it once. Not on the roundabout though. I just stalled it because I was trying to be too cocky and come off the clutch a bit too early. But to be fair, this is turning into a little bit of uh, success. It is. He's done very well, I think. not too bad. So we're going to do some shopping, put it in the car, the new car, and then we're going to... Are we going home after this? Yeah, because we need to then organise, get everything out of the boot, organise your little box. And I've got some editing to do, so... Okay, well, that'll be the end of my driving day then. This is our trolley so far. Yeah, look it's at it. It's a disgrace. Red Bull, milk chocolate biscuits, boost bites, caramel nibbles, peanut M&M &M bar, smart bones, Maltesers. Somebody coming up behind you, babe. Penguins. Babe, there's somebody behind you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, okay, stop shaming us. There is some healthy stuff underneath all this. There's like, there is some salad under there somewhere and like, <laughs> sorry. So we are back from our day out of driving in the range and everything. We are now going to put up the new, new canvas. And we've got those little, what are they? Like, you know, they, they don't need nails or anything. Uh, the damage free hand hanging commando brand thing. Holds up, hold, holds up to four kilos. It's not commando. Command. <laughs> Sorry, not commando. That's very nice. Oh, feel this. Oh, it's embellished. How do I get these off? It's like a gloss finish, high gloss finish. Right, where do you want it? I want it up here, so that means we need to put this one down. Okay. What, and you want it slap bang there? where it was. Well, that looks weird there, doesn't it? Do you think? I don't know. I think it looks all right. This is where we've put it, but I just feel like it makes the wall, I don't know, I'm just not sure about it being in the middle. Can you hold it like above my dresser? Then that wall looks a little bit blank. I might need to get another one. What do you think? Just the wall looks a bit empty there. I know. So I for the time being, maybe we should put it here and then we can get another one. Not the same, obviously. What's going on here? We can get another one and then we can move that one here and then put another one there. Have a look from a different angle. 
Yeah, I suppose it's just, yeah, all of this wall is very blank, but we could get another one, we get another one. there, maybe. Because we could put I don't know, it just all looks so cluttered with the stuff I've got on the dresser and stuff. It yeah, all looks I a bit cluttered. What we could do is we could put it above the dressing table and then we could put another one here so they're in line with each other. Yeah? Yeah, and then we're going to put the old one, which we've got down here, above the bed here. So we'll get to work on that. So we're just sticking the bits on. I don't really understand how it works. So that's stuck to look, that. Like... Yeah, so look, that's stuck to that. Yeah. yeah? So it's not coming off. Then this. Is it like Velcro? Yeah. So then you push it in. And then that side sticks, and then that sticks, sticks to, the wall. to the wall. And it's meant to come off the wall and not make any marks, isn't it? Yeah. Probably not anyway. It's on top of the wall. It's on top of the bed. Hang on. Are we getting a headboard? Yeah. But that will only come to just above the pillows. Okay. So, so bear with, bear with, bear with, bear with. Got to see if it's in the middle. A little bit lower. Mm. Yeah, I suppose I can always move the bed a bit a little bit anyway. Yeah, go. That'd be straight. And that's going to fall on our heads in the middle of the night. <laughs> <laughs> better not. No, no, it's on there safe. That was from Dunelm, I think. I got it that's quite it. a long time ago, but... It's perfect. Okay, he's kicked some of my pillows out, but... Move your big head, babe. Perfect. Well done. That's my handiwork done. If you need a builder, call Bob. Don't ask me. <laughs> right, guys, we're signing off for the day. We're just going to have a chilled day. We'll chilled back... afternoon. On my Netflix. We'll be back tomorrow um, with some more driving fun. And um, uh, we might drive over to my mum and dad's um, mm -hmm. to drop off some bits and pieces. And that's in Marlis. So it's a 20 minute drive. Yeah, so it's it a good 20 minutes. Um, if you don't hear from us tomorrow afternoon, then maybe call the police or the ambulance service but um so that guys hope you enjoyed bye, bye.